Hey loves, Mahania here, and today I'm sharing with you a few changes that I made to my mini happy planner. If you're interested in watching, please stay tuned. I started off the year with my mini happy planner inside a hard cover. But I changed that out because I wanted to have pockets. So I picked up this rose gold mini happy planner deluxe cover. I absolutely love it. And I also put larger discs on. So these are Disc Agenda Rose Gold 1.65 Disc. And they worked out perfectly. I was going to order the Happy Planner Expander Disc, but they were a bit too large. I wouldn't have been able to close my cover. I ordered gold expander disc for my classic happy planner. I will link the video in the description box below. These discs are 1.65. The happy planner expander discs are 1.75. I will leave a link to the disc agenda disc in the description box below if anyone is interested in purchasing these. I also have a mini happy planner set up for 2018. I will also link that video so that you can go check it out and see how I started the year in my mini happy planner and you can see the changes that I have made recently. So I have a protective sheet here and these two by two cards are from happy planner except for this card here which I got in a memory keeping kit from the 99 cents only store i have a piece of vellum that i cut down and this is a image that i got from pinterest as well as this image here i got these doilies from joanne's fabric and this clip is from michael's i keep half sheets here for notes another sheet of vellum and in my don't forget section I keep my date on one page so this is basically a storage section for them because when I get ready to use one I actually move it and you'll see that in a little bit This is my social media planner where I plan out my video post as well as my social media posts. So Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter. I like to keep track of my channel views as well as my subs. So I make a note of where I was at the first of the month and also at the end of the month, which I forgot to mark down for the end of January. So I keep track here of when I post the videos and I also write down a schedule for videos that I would like to post and what day I would like to post them on. I also write in reminders to post to Instagram and Snapchat I kind of just post whenever right now. Twitter I always post when I post an Instagram picture. I hit the share to Twitter button so that way if someone is following me on Twitter they get a notification that I just posted to Instagram and here is an example of how I use my week on two page inserts I love to decorate because it makes me excited about planning in my planner and so Tuesday this was January 2nd and so I wrote notes to myself to film videos and after I have completed the task I go back and I highlight it and I like to highlight in a color close to my layout for that week. Here's this week's layout, very simple. My son's birthday was this week, his birthday is actually February 29th so we celebrated on the 28th as well as the first so I didn't really work that much this week so here I marked to do this video that I'm filming right now on Monday 
which I did it but I forgot a lot of important details so I'm refilling it now for you all and just wrote down the plans we had and I have a half sheet here for notes but I didn't end up writing any and here we have the date on the page I was asked the question on Instagram how I use these inserts and where I place them inside of my happy planner so I place these day on the page in the middle of the week so that I can go into detail about that day just in case there's not enough space here and on the back side of this page there is a brain dump section and I also want to show you the month for March which is pretty much clear now I am going to get to work on putting out all of the request videos I have and just catching up we've been having some remodeling going on and I really haven't been feeling well lately so I have a lot of catching up to do and I apologize for the lapse in videos that's pretty much all the updates that I have made to my happy planner I use this page here each month to plan out my goals for my social media accounts so I set my monthly goals here how many videos I would like to upload blog posts that I would like to do and things of that nature I have a note here don't forget snapchat and blog things that I'm reading because I'll be sharing them on most inspiration and also audiobooks that I am listening to I did add a dashboard midway or it may have been in there before but I decided to decorate it these little mini calendars came out of the same kit from the 99 cent store as the tribal print 2x2 two two card that I showed you in the front this is a 2x3 mini photo that I printed on my LG pocket printer and I just cut it down this is a project life card as well as this card here all of these little decorative 2x2s two came in that same kit from the 99 cents home store I used to keep my mile liners in this case but now I'm using it for my mini happy planner storage and these are just some items that I picked up from the dollar store so here is my cover which I'm thinking about just flipping this over and using it as a dashboard in the front or sticky notes and here's one of my folders that I usually keep in the front and it will be going back in now I just want to switch my dashboard up in honor of Black History Month I can actually pop this back in now and just have it over the dashboard and maybe just keep this page in as well but I really really love pastels especially pink um, so yeah I have my hard cover here I'm thinking about including this in the giveaway that I will be doing for my 1k celebration I just don't see myself using this hard cover but I will see I have more of those page protectors as well as my day on one page inserts and these are half sheets for my classic happy planner okay so I think that covers just about everything as always if you have any questions you can leave them in the comment section below or email me extravaglam at gmail.com remember to follow me on Instagram snapchat and Twitter at extravaglam also, come over and join us on Facebook in our Extravaglamies group. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.